Hey guys, hope you are all doing good. So today in this video, we will be discussing about a very interesting topic. And this video is being made on request of one of my subscriber. So before we go on into our video, make sure you subscribe to the channel and stay updated. So our topic for today is going to be about how to culture moina in bulk amount. Moina is a live food and it is very crucial for rapid growth of a fish. So let's get started and learn more. Every tiny little thing which is moving over here is called Moina. And today in this video I'll be telling you how to mass produce this Moina culture so that you could have enough of Moina to feed your fish. And make sure you subscribe to the channel before we get into this video. The main thing which plays a crucial role to culture moina in bulk amount is that we need to feed it with good food. And this food could be prepared by using only three ingredients. They are yeast, of course, sugar and water. We need to make sure that we use only room temperature water because using too hot or too cold water may kill the yeast cells and they don't get activated. Remember that our motive is to activate the yeast cells and not to kill them. So that these active yeast cells will be eaten by our moina and our moina will reproduce. And the other main thing is that you require a moina starter. Without a moina starter you cannot produce moina. I am selling this moina starter at a very less price. You can message me on Instagram for order. First you need to take a bottle filled with some water. Remember to use only room temperature water cause I told you what would happen if not. Then you need to take some sugar. Uh, I am just showing this for you on purpose. Don't use so much amount of sugar. A little bit of sugar is enough. Now as you could see over here this is the amount of sugar I used in this uh, for this bottle. Uh, for the amount of water in it. And we need not to make the water so sweet. Then you need to take yeast. And remember to use only active dry yeast because it's the only thing which activates the yeast cells. And we in, in the market we have other type of yeast like instant yeast and normal dry yeast. And we don't use that because they don't get they don't activate the yeast cells. After that you need to shake all this together and just place it uh, for a while without disturbing it. After some time if you observe that you will see that there is a small fuzzy like thing on top of the top layer of that water. It indicates that our yeast got activated and it's ready to feed. Now what you need to do is to prepare a next equipment. Our next equipment consists of a glass, syringe and a cloth and of course the activated yeast. All you have to do is to take an empty glass something like this and place the cloth on top of it. And now you need to pour this yeast in it. Okay? It's that simple. Now you just wait for a while until everything gets sink to the bottom. I mean everything gets filtered out. After a while if you check then you could see that uh, this is the amount of uh, active yeast we have managed to collect. Now I am showing you my Moina culture. This is the mosquito net I placed on top so to avoid mosquitoes so don't worry. You see over there those are the Moina which are swimming freely and it's algae water. Now all you have to do is pick up uh, the syringe and fill it with this uh, yeast water and just one pull is enough for them. I got other Moina cultures uh, with me so that I'll be using the remaining water for them. Okay, so this is how you make food for Moina and after this you could see that the Moina will be produced in a bulk amount. Thank you. And that's a whole lot of information I guess and I hope you guys learned something new and in that I mentioned that I use algae water for my moina right and you guys don't worry you can use old aquarium water for your moina culture and it works good. If you want to prepare algae water take some old aquarium water and place it in sunlight for a week then you will be 
left with algae water thank you so much for watching this video i hope you guys will subscribe to my channel and i'll meet you soon with another informative video and that's it for now see you soon